It's uh, 3 o'clock now. Just got home from school. Uh, about to leave Colorado. Packing everything up. Making sure we got it all. Flight leaves at 6.40, so we're going to leave here around 4. And then head on down to the airport. Okay, we're back here at the CBG airport. We're freshly out of the bathroom. We're going to go on one of these little spinning thingies. There's Mitch right there, cruising. What's going on, fellas? It's about uh, about <laughs> We're just chilling here. CBG. Currently about to board after uh, an hour and a half wait. Um, it is approximately. Uh, that would be uh, approximately eight. I don't. I just bought this analog watch. I don't really know how to read it. But it's seven, seven, <laughs> I can't. I can't. It's nighttime. Seven forty-five. It's nighttime outside, so we're coming soon, Jake. Wait, are you? City of Denver. Union Station there. Good old downtown Denver. There's Logo and Sean. Sean, Sean thinks he knows where he's going. Maybe. Maybe. He's working for We've been all up since 6 o'clock, and it's 2 in the morning, and we still haven't gotten to the hotel. We're about a half an hour walk. I guess Logan's still pretty hyped, but me and Sean are ready to go. Just made it to the hotel room. Looks sketchy as hell, but it's actually pretty nice. Machine's figuring out our ride for tomorrow. Yeah. Full size king bed. So we're all sharing. Easily can fit three men on that bed. Then we got a nice bathroom. Quality view up here from the fourth floor. We're gonna go party down there later on. Right next to you. This is living, Nick. This is living. This is living. Oh, I have a Beautiful view we got from up here. Goes downtown. Just how we do it, you know. 5:30. We have a bus ride at um, seven, maybe. Yeah. Oh, ride the Uber. Walking on the stairs. Just got on the uh, Greyhound bus. Two going to spring. Made it off the bus. We made it. Uh, waiting on the old Jake Jones. We don't know how he's gonna get us, but he says he knows where he's at. We haven't had anything to eat since last night at what two o'clock. You know. Yeah. We walk till there's no more sidewalk. We are. We're outside the golf course, calling Jake because he's pissed off because we did exactly what he told us not to do. So hopefully. He'll be able to find us. <laughs> yeah. On Route 6. Show him the view. I guess Highway 6, whatever it's called. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck are you driving, Jake? The new whip, bro. <laughs> I call Shotty. What's up, buddy? <laughs> What's on it? <laughs> is this your new car? Are you buying it? No, this is mine. No, it's not. Yeah, it's twin turbo. <laughs> twin turbo. <laughs> oh, on our way to uh, Aspen. Gonna hike the Continental Divide. Welcome to where I live. That's what we do every day, baby. This is the place. Got the There's the there. twin turbo. Oh. <laughs> 
Holy shit. That's awesome. I told you guys you were, were going to see some shit today, I wasn't kidding. Yeah, you're right. The Audi is pushing. Oh. Just chugging along. It's starting to get really real. Like, Eat more real than off. before. Show them the road. Show them the road. We made it up. We're there, boys. Keep it recording. We fucking made it. We're at the uh, Continental Divide right now. It's about uh, almost 1,300 feet. I think 1290. It's about 315 in the afternoon, October 7th. It's your boy's birthday. 315. It's That's me. And his new... Turn uh, around, bro. The Audi Audi Tur Twin wow. turbo. We're here, baby. Oh my god, it's Mount Everest. Our first base camp, here we come. <laughs> hit, it, hit it, Logan. Wow! <laughs> yeah, there's a path that goes up to the head. The head Are you allowed to walk not on the path? Yeah. Alright, I know I, where I'm going. I can't speak the air again, but I gotta go where I want. My dad can't say no. Dude, this is, trail which I it is no that joke, is bro. Up around that uh, mountain range. It's a trail, kind of. We did not bring adequate clothing. We don't have gloves or hats. Yeah. Alright, so we made it about halfway up. Not too bad. No. We're kind of split decision on going all the way up, but we'll probably end up making it. You didn't know, we're going all the way up there. So do those things. Uh, I a rope, we kind of tied it around. We got a nice drop off down. up here. Honestly, yeah. if somebody wants to sit on that. We lost Jake's key. So, <laughs> somewhere on the mountain. Don't know where. So, we, we are not making peak in finding the key. Still looking for Jake's key. Uh, it's probably down at this one spot we stopped to take pictures at. Walk of shame for Sheen. Came up empty handed. Still trying to figure out what we're going to do. Okay, so here's the update. It's on its phone. So the key cannot be found. It's gone for sure. So we hitched a ride uh, down the mountain in the back of these ditch truck beds that we saw skiing and doing backflips and stuff. So thanks a million to these fellows. So now we're just going to get down the mountain and figure out where we go from there. Hopefully, get a key made. I don't know. We'll see. Back in Aspen. We just got dropped off by some nice fellows in a uh, uh, Sierra. Oh, no, really old one, too. Uh, Froze our asses off. Yeah, it was about a 12 mile fucking. It seemed like a 12 mile. You guys had goats. I'm sitting here with a panel and a long sleeve shirt on. Yeah, we just got a good view, though. Oh, my God. My hands are so good. So, we really don't know what we're doing or where we're, how we're getting back tonight or if we're getting back tonight. We got a locksmith on the way. Um, he's picking Jake up. We got the key fob. He quoted this about 250 bucks. We are currently in the uh, bottom of some hotel thing. We're waiting on 
uh, Sean and Jake to get back because they just went with the locksmith. So it should be like an hour. Yeah, that, a minimum. Yeah, Easy because they got to go all the way up to the top. So and hopefully, get, hopefully get to key main, but we'll see what happens. Still waiting in this hotel lobby. They've been gone for about uh, two and a half hours. And we went around and walked around Aspen for a while and uh, went up on the ski slopes actually. And we're hoping that they come back with a car. Uh, otherwise, we gotta catch a bus to Glenwood Springs. Just got to the bus station. It's, uh, what time is it? It's 10.30. Um, we were unsuccessful in getting the car tonight, but we have a key made tomorrow, so we're taking the bus station back to Glenwood Springs. We got on the bus. We gotta take like a million stops to get back to Glenwood. The car's getting picked up tomorrow. Uh, gonna get fixed tomorrow. We're gonna do a bunch of sweet shit tomorrow. These guys are knocked out. They're running on like two hours of sleep. Finally made it to Jake's um, dorm room after getting accused by the RA of hitting the bars. <coughs> so I made it to the bus. Well, yeah, the bus took like an hour and twenty minutes. And it took us like 30 to get there the first time, so. Sean's in the shower, Logan's getting ready, Jake's asleep, kind of. Yeah. I, I, guess, I guess not. Hopefully we get the car back today, so we can get over. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. <laughs> About to head back out to Aspen. Literally missed the bus by two seconds. Oh yeah, no, we pulled in. As we're pulling in, bus here is going all the way around and pulling out. Nick's like, bet it's going to Aspen. It was going to Aspen. It was, it was yeah, going to Aspen. Been going to I'm gonna go see if the uh, car's done. I don't like those string things. because they have Fingers them. crossed. We're at this guy's shop, because he told Jake earlier today that uh, he'd finish his car the you know the keys at like four so it's like 550 so we figured we'd head on over here and see how things were going dude's not even here but on the bright side we got our food called the locksmith said he's not probably not gonna be done with it till tomorrow but he'll have it by the end of the weekend so we hop back on the bus at the airport now we're riding to glenwood to go eat some barbecue uh uh, it's 8.45, we are in downtown Glenwood Springs, just got dropped off on the bus. There goes the bus. Um, seven hours till our bus leaves. We have seven hours till our bus leaves, we're planning on not sleeping at all. Just made it to the restaurant. Uh, we got our orders in. Logan got a uh, order of chicken fingers like normal. <laughs> <laughs> I would have gotten chicken fingers, but they didn't have them on the menu, so I wanted a cheeseburger. Yeah. Literally a burger with cheese on it. <laughs> it is now 12.35. We are just chilling here, waiting until about 3 o'clock to leave to catch our bus. Uh, Mitch is just here chilling. Shane's a little tired this evening. There's Jake. So we're just counting down the hours till we have to leave. Two. Okay, so it's about 3 o'clock in the morning. Jake just got just off the bus stop. Boarding it. 335 then 3 hour ride right to the airport. So. Heading home right now. Uh, timing worked out pretty well. We have about 20 minutes extra before when we got to the need. And then uh, we took an Uber from the bus stop to the airport. So we're heading back to Cincy.